experience. My name is Danae, and we are here shooting on location in my kitchen with three very special guests. My kids! Who are you? Rebecca. Who are you? Ben. And who are you? Rebecca. Rebecca, Grace, and Josiah are going to help show us what our theme for this month is going to be. What are we making today? Christmas cookies! Christmas cookies! And that's our theme for this month, is we are making Christmas cookies. And with a new theme, we have a new memory verse. Now we're gonna check in with Lisa, who's going to show it to us. Ready, let's watch it. Boys and girls, let's do the memory verse together. Here we go. God loved us so much that he gave us his son. John 3, 16. Let's try that one more time. God loved us so much that he gave us his son. John 3, 16. Wow, is that a cool memory verse? Yeah! Yeah, it was such a cool memory verse. Now, kiddos, you have all picked out your favorite Christmas cookie cutter. Rebecca, can you show me what yours is? A candy cane. A candy cane, awesome. And Grace, can you show the boys and girls what you picked? A snowflake. A snowflake. And Josiah, what about you? The angel. The angel, cool. Boys and girls, which cookie cutter would you pick? Now, Josiah, I see you picked the angel. Now, in the Christmas story, is there any angels? Yeah. yeah! Yeah! Who does the angel talk to in the Christmas story? Mary! Mary! You know what? Let's check in with Ollie and friends and see what the angel had to say to Mary. Who? Who? You know what time it is? It's time to hear a story. do we need? Oh, wow, yes, look at that. Oh, well, hello there, friends. Or should I say Merry Christmas to you? And a big welcome to the Christmas Clubhouse. It's me, Manny, and I'm so happy to see you today. As you can see, we've been very busy decorating. We're having the best time. Look at this cool decoration that I found. Do you know what this is? That's right, it's a beautiful angel. Now I have to figure out where to put it. I have to find the perfect place. Hmm. Oh. Wow, a basket. The note says, Merry Christmas from Miss Kathy Sue. My favorite, Miss Kathy Sue's Christmas cookies. Yummy. And even better, they're shaped like angels. Just like my new angel decoration. I'm so excited. Who? Who? Hey, it's Ollie. Hello, Manny. Who? Who? Decorating for Christmas, are you? Hi, Ollie. I sure I am. I was just looking at the Christmas cookies from Miss Kathy Sue. They shape like angels, just like my new angel decoration. Those angel cookies are special. It's true. I have a story about another special angel for you. Just listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Welcome to my cupcake food truck. I'm just getting it all decorated for Christmas. 
Have you started decorating at your house? Wonderful! <laughs> I have some very special cupcakes to show you today. Are you ready? Ta-da! <laughs> See, I have cupcakes with angel wings, and my good friend Miss Kathy Sue made these angel cookies today too. As you can see, we are all excited for Christmas and angels have a big part in the story. If you're ready for the story, on the count of three, yell, tell me a story. One, two, three, tell me a story. Okay, so like I said, angels are a big part of the true story of Christmas. They came to announce the gift that God was giving everyone. Do you like to get gifts? <laughs> Me too! <laughs> Here are some special gifts now. Which would you rather have? A soccer ball or a scooter? <laughs> That's great! Both are super fun gifts. Let's try another one. Which gift would you rather have? A train or a giant stuffed teddy bear? <laughs> great! Both are wonderful gifts. Now think about it. Why do we give gifts? Is it to show someone we love them? Yes! <laughs> well, God loves you and me so, so much that he gave us the most special gift. It all started long ago when God sent an angel to a girl named Mary. Whoa! Look! There's the angel! Mary was surprised and afraid. Everyone show me your just saw an angel face. <gasps> <laughs> but the angel said, Do not be afraid, Mary. God wants you to know that you're going to have a baby and you should call him Jesus. And he will be so special because here it comes. The reason why Jesus is so special. Drum roll, please. Jesus is so special because Jesus is God's son. <laughs> When Mary heard this, she told the angel that she would do what God wanted her to do. And that is the beginning of the Christmas story. An angel told Mary that God was giving us a very special gift. His son, Jesus. Jesus is God's son. Did you like the story? If you did, give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. <laughs> oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me, why is Jesus special? Jesus is God's son. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, why is Jesus special? Jesus is God's son. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Now there's more to this story, so we'll see you next time. Bye. So there's your story. It's all true. The angel visited Mary to tell her about baby Jesus. Who? Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, what a great story. The angel told Mary that she was gonna have baby Jesus. I love hearing the true story of Christmas. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did say got it, get it? Got it! Good. You know what? Whenever I look at these angels, I'll think about the angel that told Mary that she was gonna have baby Jesus. I'll see you guys next time. Merry Christmas and bye. watching the video with Ollie and his friends, we know what the angel said to Mary. Josiah, what was something the angel said? Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid, that's right. And did Mary obey God even though she might have been afraid? Yes. Yes, and Rebecca, what did the angel say that was going to happen to Mary? He is going to give birth to God's son. She was going to give birth to God's son. That sounds like a really big job. job. Yeah. Did she say yes, even though it was a big job? Yes. Yes. And Grace, what did the angel say the baby's name would be? Jesus. Jesus. That's right. That means Jesus is God's son. Now, boys and girls, Mary obeyed God and did 
what God asked. Now, does God ever ask us to do things? Yes! 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 And can we say yes too? Yes! Even if it's a really big job? Yes! Even if we're scared? Yes! Absolutely. Now, can you pray with me? Together, let's put our hands together and close our eyes. God, we thank you that you sent your son Jesus to earth and that Mary listened to you and obeyed what you had for her. God, we pray that you would help us to obey when you have things for us to do. Even if we're scared, even if it's a big job, we thank you that you are right there with us. In Jesus' name, amen! Okay, I smell something. Well, we're gonna go get those cookies and we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye! Bye. for all the world.